It's now a friendship that began many years ago on unfriendly terms. When settlers were moving west, they wanted that land. Incidents like the Sand Creek Massacre laid the bedrock for bad blood between Native American Indians and the settlers. To have to witness that and see your people go through it, I think that would be really hard. Sometimes healing takes many forms, like a high school mascot. Really, the uh, Lindsey Nichols, that senior, um, came to me with the idea of exploring it, and it was simultaneous to the bill going through Congress at the time. In 2014, Strasburg High contacted the Northern Arapaho tribe for their input and suggestions to make the Strasburg mascot Native American Indian a symbol of honor. We listen to the tribal members and I think that's the key is to listen to their their opinions and their concerns and their history um, and follow their lead. The Northern Arapaho responded and the two groups created a new mascot. And I think that right there is what the world needs is respect. So there was respect on both sides. They met each other in the middle and they came up with a, with a good logo. I love it. Yeah, I think it's, um, but mainly because they do. So really it's a matter of being in tune with their, their ideas about how to honor them best. Now, a powwow of celebration happens every year at Strasburg High School, home of the Indians. Dan Deru, Fox 31.